Hello viewers, this is your tutorial on how to automate profile endorsement on LinkedIn using Socinator. If you want to endorse someone's skills on LinkedIn, then Socinator can help you out. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your LinkedIn account and hit Go to Tools. It will take you to the Account Configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on LinkedIn through Socinator. Let's scroll to the right and click Profile Endorsement. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to endorse the skills of a number of people within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for profile endorsement activity. The first one is connection sources or the sources of your LinkedIn connections. Check by software if you want to target connections made by Socinator. Check outside software if you want to target the LinkedIn connections you made yourself. You may also check custom users list which allows you to enter a specific profile URL. Simply copy and paste the profile URL of the LinkedIn user you want to target in this area. You may clear using the clear all button and it's gone. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Select the right file and click open. When you're done, click the save button over here. Endorsement criteria will allow you to specify the number of skills you want to endorse. Let's say five for example. The next tool is job configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should endorse profiles. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use, like slow with an average daily activities of 16, medium with 41, fast with 83, or super fast with 125. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, Click Advanced Settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each profile endorsement. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes a software should pause after endorsing the number of profiles you set and number of profile endorsements per job. Number of profile endorsements per job will allow you to specify the number of LinkedIn profiles you want to endorse per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of LinkedIn profiles you want to endorse per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of max profile endorsements per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep endorsing profiles even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on, let's say, Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click add interval and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day, let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m., click add interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it LinkedIn Profile Endorsement and click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time and choosing LinkedIn Profile Endorsement. The next tool is User Filters. This allows us to filter the profiles we want to endorse on LinkedIn. So check the first one if you want to target those who have profile pictures. Check the second one if you want to target those who have at least 500 connections. Check the third one if you want to target those who have enabled advanced bio and skills. The next one will allow you to specify the minimum number of characters in the bio of the profiles you want to target. Next we have must contain specific words. These are the words that should be in the bio description of the profiles you want to target. Let's say you want to target expert for example. Type in this area. You may clear using the clear all button and it's gone. You may also import from CSV or text file by clicking this button. Select the right file and click open. And when you're done, click save. 
The next one is the opposite of the previous one, must not contain specific words. So these are the words that should not be in the bio description of the profiles you want to target. So let's say you don't want to target those who are fresh graduates. So type in this area and again you may clear or import using these buttons and click save when you're done. The next one will allow you to specify the minimum number of skills of the profiles. So let's say at least five. Check the remaining ones if you want to target those who have experience and education details. The last tool is manage blacklisted users. Blacklisted users are the LinkedIn profiles you do not want Socinator to interact with. If you check this box, then blacklisted users will not be endorsed. This can either be a private blacklist, which belongs to a specific LinkedIn account, or a group blacklist, which is shared between all the accounts you add. When you're satisfied with all the configurations and are ready to start endorsing profiles on LinkedIn, let's scroll up and click Save. Success. After saving, let's click the Status button to make it active. Now that it's active, let me show you another option in automating profile endorsement on LinkedIn through Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the Social drop-down button and select LinkedIn. This will take us to the Accounts tab. Let's switch to the Profile Endorsement tab. Here, we can name our campaign. Let's call it LinkedIn Profile Endorsement. For connection sources, let's select by software or by Socinator. For number of skills, let's choose five. For job configuration, let's select slow. For user filters, let's check must have profile picture, 500 plus connections, and experience and education details. Finally, let's skip blacklisted users, private blacklist. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple LinkedIn accounts. Since you only have one account right now, let's go with that by checking the box and click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click your account and the save button. This will automatically bring us to the Campaigns tab where you can see that we have successfully created our LinkedIn profile endorsement campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.